Welcome back. Not only are car shoppers having to pay more for used cars since the mm -hmm. pandemic, now Carfax reports more are being ripped off. And we're talking ah. a lot of ripoffs. Yes. Unbelievable amount. Carfax says the number of vehicles on Texas roads with rolled back odometers had increased 13% in the last two years. Consumer reporter Heather Sullivan joins us live with smart sense on how to spot it before you buy the car. Good morning again, Heather. Yeah, good morning. Yeah, they say it's 277,000 more rolled back vehicles just in Texas in the last two years. And they say the average car buyer is gouged by about $4,000 when you buy a car with a rolled back odometer. Plus, you're going to have higher maintenance costs because that car really has higher mileage. So Carfax made this video to show us just how quick and easy it is for scammers to roll back an odometer. Take a look. On the odometer right now, I've got 124,000 miles. So in my device, I've already inputted about 43,000 miles. So we can knock off 80 in just the flip of a switch, basically. So here are three quick things you can check before you buy a vehicle. You can for free put the VIN number in a car on the Carfax website, and it will give you a free report on the history of the mileage. Uh, so you can compare that to the odometer. You can also, of course, buy a vehicle history report. Always a good idea before you buy a car. You can also check the car's title and its safety inspection records. Those will have some mileage history on it. So then if you look at that mileage number on the vehicle, if it's lower than any of those reported numbers, that's a sign that that odometer has been rolled back. Okay, so you got to tell us if there's signs that you could actually see in the car of maybe some tampering that's going on. Yeah, one of the telltale signs they say is to just take a look at the brake and gas pedals. If they show a lot of wear like this car, this car has 124,000 miles on it, so you know that, that those two things go together. But if you've got worn pedals like that and the mileage is a lot lower, that's a sign that something is off. Also, have a mechanic inspect the car. Always a great idea before you buy so you know exactly what you're getting. Mm -hmm. All right, thanks, Heather. You know, I've been talking about being in the market for a while, and you just keep yeah. enlightening yeah. Me to more things I need to look out for, so I appreciate it. You won't get scammed on my watch. Thank you, Heather. That's Thank you. That's my girl. Right there.